Oh my god. This one. Big and that is huge. <laughs> Do we have a scale? Holy cow. Hey guys, welcome back to another North Star Fishing video. Today we are on the little paddle boat out in our bay here and we caught a giant smallmouth um, and a different mystery fish that we have never caught in this bay before. Um, so we just came out here for a little while, like an hour and a half right before sunset, which is going on right now. And um, just throwing a little bitsy bug jig and uh, take a look. It's time to smack them, that's all I'm saying. A little bitsy bug jig, a little yum or zoom chunk on there. Black and blue, stained water. Let's get bit. Oh no, that was a wave. Should we anchor right here? This one, big and big and oh my god, giant. No, it's a big smallie. Oh my gosh, dude, right at the boat, giant smallie, giant smallie, huge, huge. Oh my god, five pounder, five pounder, five pounder. Oh my god, oh my god, dude, five pounder, five pound smallie, smallmouth, giant, giant, giant. It's a giant smallie. How are we gonna land it? Um, gonna have to reach down and grab it after I tear it out. Oh my god. Giant. Nope. I'm gonna grab him. If I lose him, I don't want, I want it to be my fault. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, giant. This might be my PB. Oh my gosh, come here, buddy. I gotta keep the rod bent. Gotta keep the rod bent. Oh my god. Oh my gosh, giant. Oh my gosh, don't jump, jump, jump. Don't, no, 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 no. Don't jump. Giant smallmouth. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Giant smallmouth. Holy crap. Oh. Holy crap. Giant smallmouth. Huge. That is huge. Oh my gosh. Dude. Do we have a scale? Holy cow. All right, folks, take a look at that smallmouth. That's a big in, dude. First fish of the day. Hit the bitsy bug jig right in front of the yacht, or right in front of the paddle boat. And uh, yeah, that is going to be an awesome fish. Uh, we're going to get a get a weight on it quick and then get it back. It's probably about a three or four pounder. There is the lure that just cooked that stud up. Um, forgot to get the weight. We just got, grabbed pictures and let it go, but probably four pounder at four least. Five. Yeah, around there somewhere, but who knew? This close to the cabin, we're able to pull fish like that. Let's fish all of this. So there's a ton of big rocks, like that's a big boulder, but there's a ton of them all across this. This is a, just a big boulder flat. There's smallmouth sitting in here, so. See if we can get any other ones. I don't got too many. I only got. Oh, this is my last one. Oh, this? Good wow. corn up from all the big bass. I know. Jig is so small. Let's rig it up just like it's any other trailer. Pull that out like that. There you are. Dude, you are screwed. I know I am, but it might be a little bit. See these clouds? Oh, yeah, big storm clouds. Oh, it's wait. perfect for the these conditions, and then you got the wind coming through. I got one. Oh my god, it's a walleye! Is that a walleye on a bass jig? It is! Oh my god, and it's not a bad one! 
No way! What? At the island? At the island? You're joking. Are you kidding me? You are joking. We have never ever caught a walleye. Bring it home. In, in this in the keeper. bay. That's a keeper. That is crazy, dude. Keep it. You don't have anywhere to put it. Um, we'll have to let him go. All right, buddy. Dude. What a walleye on a bass jig in our bay. I'm surprised you're not even this surprised when you caught that nice bass. We rarely catch fish in our bay besides like rock bass under docks. And, and let alone a giant smallmouth and a walleye. Like that's incredible. I don't know if it's the conditions pushing these fish in here to feed or what's going on here, but dude, we never ever see this. This is wild.